On 27th November, the Mauna Loa volcano erupted for the first time in 38 years. The last eruption was recorded in 1984 and the volcano has erupted 33 times since 1843. Mauna Loa takes up more than half of the big island in Hawaii and rises 13,679 feet above the Pacific Ocean. When it erupted in March and April of 1984, it sent a flow of lava within about 8 kilometers of the city of Hilo. The eruption is currently concentrated in Mauna Loa's northeast rift zone, where lava is flowing from at least one split in the volcano, according to the US Geological Survey. An ash fall warning was issued by the government, which means that ash rain was expected due to suspended airborne ash. The National Weather Service in Honolulu said that ash from the volcano reached up to 45,000 feet and cautioned that winds may carry volcanic gas like sulfur dioxide, ash and volcanic glass fibers known as Pele's hair downwind, which can be dangerous to sensitive groups like children and people with respiratory ailments. Moreover, volcanic ash clouds can also pose aviation risk, reduce visibility, damage flight controls and cause jet engines to fail. The neighboring Kilauea volcano has been erupting regularly since September 2021. When it erupted in 2018, it destroyed over 700 homes and sent lava across farms and the ocean. Historically, each Mauna Loa eruption has lasted a few weeks. This eruption is expected to follow a similar pattern as well. While evacuation orders have not been issued as yet, Two shelters have been opened and several roads have been closed as precautionary measures.